What's up everybody? Buzzy Games Beth here. Today let's learn how to make mirrors. All you really need is a plugin and that's it. It's by it's called Portal Maker underscore V2 by Cody York for I'll make sure to link that to you guys down below. So once you have that all installed, Roblox Studio should start up. But before we start using that plugin, let's go ahead and make our mirror. So what we need right now is just any kind of part. Obviously, I'm just going to use you know, a simple part like this. I'm going to scale it down, make it a little thin. And yeah, that's my mirror. You can, you know, change the transparency of it if you would like. Um, let's go ahead and create a duplicate of this and literally put it right next to it. That's it. So you have two parts, all right? And they're right next to each other. Cool. So pretty simple so far, that's done. Go ahead and highlight both of them. You now you can set the transparency of it. I'm gonna do zero point, let's see. 0.75, yeah, that looks good. Cool, we can see through it, but it's not all clear. <laughs> All right, so go ahead and open up the plugin, the Portal Maker V2 that we just downloaded. So what you're gonna do is highlight both of your parts, click start, it's gonna ask you if you can make changes to your scripts, that's cool. Click allow and then click create. So go ahead and name your portal world to whatever, it's just gonna create a folder. So I'm just gonna call it tip, like a tip tutorial. And then you should see in your explorer page that a folder was automatically created called tip. So go ahead and delete the skies. You don't really need it. That's it, you're done. So if you hop into your game, you'll see that right away. If you walk in front of your part, you have a reflection of yourself. You got yourself a mirror. Pretty neat, right? So as always, if you enjoyed this comment, leave a like and give us a subscribe and stay tuned for the next video. And as always, have fun creating. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.